Greeting suns and moons, and of course I have to welcome back all my stars if you're new to the channel and you resonate with my energy, go ahead and hit that subscription button. We would love to have you here with us on this healing journey. I've already done my meditation and called in the appropriate guidance, protection, and coverage needed for us. I just ask that you be tarot's about energy. We have high vibe, we got low vibe, we got those in the middle, no striving to be in the middle. Now, with that being said, this may or may not resonate with you. Parts may resonate, parts may not. Take what's for you and leave the rest. This could resonate for somebody that you're thinking of, somebody that's thinking of you, an ex, a co-worker, a boss, a past over loved one, even a child, okay? So, someone has their defenses up. This person or you, okay, for some of you... Um, you're coming out of that lack mentality, okay? However, I feel like by you doing this healing, you are causing some sort of reverse effect on the person that you have your defenses up against. Very interesting. All right, so we have embrace. I feel like you are learning to love yourself a little bit uh, more. I heard perfectly imperfect, perfectly imperfect. So we have a change on the horizon. Someone needs to speak some sort of truth. Okay, I feel like for some of you, you may have spoke some sort of truth in the past. And now you're waiting for some sort of fruits um, of your labor will open up. Somebody could be wanting to reach out to you, email, text via social media, all right, um, they see your growth here, yeah, okay, so I'm getting that, you are somebody that went through some challenging times, okay, you may have closed off your heart, and during this challenging time, you may have some, met someone or someone from your past came back, that's an energetic match, for you with feeling alone and manifest some of you may be dealing with a witch or a warlock a shaman uh you know a priest high priestess for some of you even healers with the open up in patience i feel like some of you are going through a period where you may be getting some sort of upgrade i heard ascension and this may resonate with that 1111 portal energy. I do see the Empress high vibing energy. You could be a male or female. This is Taurus and Libra energy. However, you don't have to be those signs to be in this energy. All right. So this is someone that's very fruitful. Things may be changing around you. However, you're maintaining that high vibration. With the moon here, you could be holding back some information or somebody's holding back a inf some inf information for you. For some of you, you could be pregnant or you could be a wife, okay? With Mercury being here, Gemini, Virgo, energy, some of you may have Taurus or Libra in the, your moon as well as Gemini or Virgo. However, Mercury is my entanglement card, so there's something that you do not know, Possibly this something could be being held back from you intentionally by the divine. That's what I'm hearing. Okay, so this will resonate with Libra. Something could happen in Libra season to you or to someone that you're dealing with. This part, yeah. So we have manip manip manipulation, somewhat with a distorted uh, aura. Okay, this person makes you feel uneasy. You could be in a court, I heard a courtroom battle. Yeah, somebody could have stopped you or tried to stop you from moving forward. For some of you, this could be a business situation where you had, I heard lawsuits or a legal team. Now, this could be a spiritual legal uh, team as well with, with judgment being here. We have Scorpio energy and the magician, Gemini, Virgo energy. So someone is using all their gifts in the wrong way. This could be someone that was hired to manipulate two individuals, okay? I heard demonic individuals. With the devil card here, Capricorn could have something to do with this, whether if you were the initiator, 
Someone plays judgment on someone possibly to end someone's career, to end someone's life, okay? This was something very foolish. We have Air, uh, Aquarius, Scorpionic Energy, Temperance, Sagittarius, and the Emperor. Yeah, somebody doesn't like your divine connection. Ooh, look at this. All these went reverse. So I heard this person is going to hell. Okay, so it's going to resonate different for everybody, but I see all the signs here we have. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, in the reverse, we have the world card, Cap 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 Capricorn energy in the reverse. We have the emperor. This emperor is a psychopath, uh, you know, with this being in the reverse, this could definitely be somebody has Gemini, Libra, Aquarius placements, as well as Capricorn. This could be an Aries. Uh, Sagittarius energy here. So this person could be on the cusp of Sagittarius and Capricorn for some of you. This person is, yeah, somebody just keeps pushing the envelope. I'm trying to up the ante. Okay, it made you stronger. Whoever this resonates with, give me one more card. Yeah, I feel like you were put on a time out. You had to learn how to let go, how to heal. Some of you may be doing reversals. Okay, or this person may feel like you're reversing something on to them. You're dealing with somebody that's very egotistical. This could be a Pisces sun. We have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Or you could be a Leo or a Pisces sun. This could be uh, someone's child's mother. With this sun card being next to cancer, this person could also be on the cusp of... Cancer and Leo. This is about somebody's stability, most definitely with the wheel, karmic wheel being here. I'm hearing judgment. And I'm also hearing thank you so much for granted. Give me one more card to show me. So somebody doesn't like the fact that you changed here. Like this is like this is somebody that refuses to repeat the site. Uh you may be refusing to repeat a cycle, but someone does not want to repeat the same cycle. Somebody's being tormented with this karma card, the will of fortune in the shadow, in the reverse. So I'm, I'm hearing somebody's purposely setting traps from, for someone and whoever this is, they're burying themselves deeper. Somebody's so jealous of the way either you attract money or the way that People are attracted to you. Yeah. Somebody doesn't like somebody's popularity. I heard popular loner. That may resonate with you. I don't know. But we have, <clears throat> excuse me, judgment here, Sagittarius. So this is somebody purposely um, sending out negative energy towards someone. Again, somebody could be wishing death on somebody. Uh, with the amp, yeah, this is a high priestess. I feel like you know this now. So something could have happened with somebody's car. I feel like somebody's gonna find. I heard hit and run. Somebody could have get been in some sort of accident or chase with the justice being here. Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. Somebody could have actually caused some sort of passing over of someone in a car crash. This is. I know what you did last summer. This is seeing is believing. This is my art. Okay. This is the scales balancing. Okay. So this is something that's manifesting in the ethers here. Okay. This could be a karmic lesson for some of you. You could have been with someone that was very karmic in nature. Okay. When you're around this person, a lot of things happen to other people. To you, this is a dead end situation because it's no longer protected by the divine. Somebody doesn't like your heart. I heard your girth. That's a new one. Okay, so this is somebody um, that that takes compassion. Like, yeah, they don't like compassionate people. Here. They don't like the fact that you've learned how to tame the inner beast with the will of fortune being here. So while they're receiving harsh karma, you're receiving good karma. For some of you, this is a new relationship. And this person over here is salty. Why is change here? You can show me what it is. Yeah, we have, yeah, somebody's jealous. 
with strawberry fields, LSD, psychedelic, psychedelic rock, okay, orphan. This person could have been in the army or they may have some sort of PTSD or something. Somebody could live in the suburbs. Somebody could have moved to a very nice neighborhood and someone is jealous. Okay. Yeah, I feel like this card keeps coming now either somebody was caught off guard by some information or somebody was literally caught off guard because somebody is definitely undergoing a transformation, something that was karmically in, in alignment. Somebody could have went to jail, that's what I'm getting. Somebody could have hit, like, you know, oof. We have chaos, conflict, and backfire. So whoever did this, because this is my backfire card, whoever put out some distorted energy, say it's not witchcraft. If they put out some dark energy towards someone that I'm getting, this could be somebody that lives in the West, either you or them. This person could be on psychedelics. With the strawberry fields, this person could like to go after, again, innocent people, and it may have triggered some sort of change within you. For some of you with the chaos, conflict, backfire, Trying to keep, seems like a male, from finding out some information. This person, this person may be the type of person that thinks someone putting their hands on them is love. Because this person embodies dark energy. Tell me more about this. Okay, so denial. Okay, so somebody could have confronted somebody. About being on the down low. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm hearing. And there could have been an argument for some of you. Why is yeah, Sagittarius? Oh, yeah. This is somebody that is a friend sexual. This could have been something that this person did in the past and say they try to clean themselves up. And it's like the past is haunting this person. They're easily tempted. You know, this is, you know, they're going to go to the store. They're going to meet somebody. They all about the money. Okay. They pretend to be nurturing, but they're really going to be toxic and make you have bubble guts because they're going to mess up your, your core center because this person sleeps with everybody with this. Look at this. Look, this person sleep with, sleeps with everybody. For some of you, this person could have slept with a friend or a family member. Tell me more about the strawberry fields, the hallucinations. So somebody say this person doesn't do uh, drugs. They could come from a very challenging background. This person may have and didn't have money, I'm hearing. So, like, they live very flamboyantly. You could have denied this person here. There's a cycle that's closing. Somebody didn't do their research. Okay. I heard a, 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 a wing and a prayer because this person keeps a lot of options. They think they have a lot of options, but it seems like they have an entity attachment or they will have one. They could, again, possibly have an incontinence problem. Okay. I heard boo-boo. I don't, yeah, hey, I, I Somebody with the science tomorrow do. This is somebody that's going to try to bend somebody's wheel here. Again, this is up under the spell work card in reverse. So it's like whatever this person does, they get instant karma in some kind of way. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. For some of you, this is somebody attempting to do some sort of sex ritual or sex magic. Like again, this could be somebody that I heard rough sex. I, I don't know whether it's the male or female. Look at that. This is this is my player card in reverse. So this could be a man or a woman. They have like a lot of sexual fantasies. Okay. Ooh. Okay, with the envy and jealous. Okay, this is somebody that thought you were an option. This person could be doing black magic spells, witchcraft, bitchcraft on you. Like, you know, because they're cuckoo for cocoa puffs. I just, whatever they've been sending out is literally taking over this person's body. 
Like, they can't, it seems like they can't help themselves. Somebody, somebody's not about to like what's coming towards them for their interference in someone's business or relationship. Because we have the emperor here in a high vibe. This could be somebody coming in between somebody's relationship. This could also be somebody that has a choice. They could have chose wrong. They end up with a drippy thong. A drippy thong. You know. Why is all the secrets here? So the secrets is they got somebody, a relationship of convenience. They have a wife or a husband. They like... You know, this person might like to go to strip clubs, okay? They even deal with uh, trans women, possibly, okay? So they're easily tempted, and they could also be bisexual. These are all secrets. Like, somebody's secrets from their past is haunting them. Where the boys are, this is somebody that will claim that they are with their friends, but they really somewhere, you know, they possibly could be with their friends. Their friends could be jealous of you and your connection. They, somebody could even have a friend that set them up with somebody that had a disease on purpose. Why is all secrets here? Yeah, okay. So, yeah, false fact, false face. Some of you found out some information or they're hoping that you don't put two and two together about this karmic cycle. Now, there could be a Capricorn in here. There could be any sign, but this is definitely speaking about demonic energy. Okay, someone that's constantly being tempted or trying to tempt you, sending dark energy towards you here. Okay, this I'm here imposter. So this person wears a mask constantly because you really don't know who they are. They have so much demonic energy. I'm hearing sexually transmitted demons. Okay, they could also be trolling you under a fake account. They don't like the fact that you've reached some sort of star status. Okay, they could also have their friends, family members. They could have something to do with this. Yeah, this person wants to message you or you did receive a message. This message which was meant to try to throw you off. Somebody's faking the funk too on the internet. Okay, somebody's very chaotic with their energy. They, they're a friend sexual, you know, they're a, a lesson, a karmic soul contract that somebody has here. This person feels... You know, if telling them to do the right thing is controlling them, okay? This is this this, this is a lesson, okay? This person is promiscuous that I, I'm hearing, whether it's a male or female, or they're only hooking up with promiscuous people. And for some of you, that is their karma here. This person really doesn't know who they are. I feel like they may have an addiction, they're addicted to toxic things, toxic energy with the pick your poison. We have the psychopath, lack of guilt, and we have the sociopath. This person pretends to feel, they pretend to care. And then at the same time, holding back emotion. So this person may just stare off awkwardly when someone displays emotions. I heard him. I'm just looking, it sleeps with family, they don't care. Somebody's going to get some information about their child's father that's going to blow them off their feet. Are you going to be a child's father and this is going to happen to you? Tell me about this. Someone smiles today. So this person is watching you, stalking you, sending you negative energy, trying to tempt you. For some of you, you are, you are male and this is a woman doing this. This person could be trying to sleep with you. I heard for money. Yeah, so for some of you, you're a male, you're watching this. So this is a younger female that was an option that's doing magic on you and possibly somebody that you had a spiritual partnership or a marriage with. For some of you, this is a karmic partner, their karmic partner. 
this person goes back and report everything to the person that's doing the magic, the lies, the spell. For some of you, it's a black widow. Yeah, look, they're being used as a tool. This is somebody that they possibly could have hooked up in secret with. They may even work at a hotel or something. I'm here in hospitality. Yeah. Know that you are never alone. This goes for all parties. The entourage. Okay. So this is his his or her smoke break or this person. You could smoke with this person during break. All right. Somebody could have met somebody at work. And now this is a toxic uh, situation. I heard chemical gases. Does somebody work at a chemical plant or something? It smells stank. I don't know. Like toxic. Like, uh, I heard fentanyl. Somebody could be a, a cook or something. I, I do not. Somebody, yeah. There was all kind of signs saying do not date this person. They could also be tracking you, going by your house with artificial intelligence. This person could be hacking your phone or trying to hack your account. Tell me more about this tool energy. Yeah. So this is a male. Either this is happening to a male or this is a male that's doing it. This person used to hook up with this younger female at a hotel. And when they did, whoever they hooked up with, <clears throat> they could have met this person online, some kind of service, like social media app or something like that i heard instagram but i i heard tinder for somebody and i heard jack Ooh, child why is your fingers crossed here mm, yeah they was hoping that you did not find this information out that they are hooked they they're hooked they're in this toxic energy this is my succubus card with the four queens look that up this is somebody that they thought was, I heard the grass was not greener. They So they was hooked on somebody's looks. Like this person could have a boo job or something. I don't know. Like a, this person could have the perfect body in their eyes. So they was lusting after this person. And the tower moment hit. They could have, this person could have turned them out, got them into drugs or something. Ooh, child, this is messy. They could have abandoned you or this person abandoned them. Why is due tomorrow here? Oh, yeah. Somebody going to send out some poisonous uh, energy either tomorrow, whenever you see this, because these are timeless. Okay. They don't like the fact that you love the person that you love or this person loves you. Yeah. For some of you, ooh, ooh. Mm -mm -mm. I'm telling you, for some of you who, for some of you, I'm hearing specifically, somebody thought somebody was their twin, okay? And this person has a baby with somebody, somebody that they was lusting after or, or, and causing tower moments in this purpose, person's life. But again, I told you this person is a friend sexual, okay? So you walked away from this person, but for some of you, this person is really gay. I'm hearing bisexual for some, but they're coming out. So this information is about to shake somebody to the core. Whoever this person thought that they was taking somebody from you, somebody that they knew loved you. Look at this. Saved by grace. Ain't that something? Spiritual warrior, healed wounds, as above, so below, as within, so without. You were saved by grace. You were always protected. This is something that you needed to know. Some of you had to heal the way that you were thinking about yourselves this person could have mentally tried to mess with you i've been getting those readings where somebody tried to put someone's intelligence in a box i'm here and try to make you absent-minded okay like demote you take you off your status i heard soapbox but that's some kind of saying an old school saying so we are here so this person that was emotionally manipulative, played head games, always kept you in their head, or they were always in their head. They get what they put out because whatever they did, it backfired. And now this person is humble. You even humbled, humbled the third party in this situation. I feel like everybody is getting humbled in this situation because somebody went after someone 
that is not even sexually attracted to them. Like, they don't even know what they want, you know? They could also have schizophrenia or they have... Um, this runs in their bloodline, okay? With the Emperor card being here, this is somebody that's very egotistical. They want it their way. I heard my way or the highway. So this person always continuously makes bad choices. I heard until they get old and gray. And some of you, this person may be starting to get gray hair. Or you may have gotten gray hair during all these cycles. You know that your angelic beings are here. Whatever entities that you tried to conjure up, it was something that was faded. Because we got a lot of people opening up portals here. Okay, they don't really know what they're doing. This is about what you don't see. This is about you being realistic. This is a karmic lesson. Okay. Using discernment. Knowing how to tell a truth from a lie. This person was definitely a lie. Tell me more about this emperor before we get up out of here. Yeah. This person, for some of you, this could, you could have a child with this person. Or they are, they have a child with somebody that's a succubus or in, uh, incubus. You see this? I'm not superstition. That's superstitious. Okay, so this is somebody that didn't believe in spirituality, possibly even religion, and it backfired because they ended up hooking up with someone that is very toxic or having children that are toxic, chaotic, manipulative, or this could be this emperor. Yeah, there's towers happening, happening left and right on whoever is happening here. And this is a clarity for you. You could also receive a message. You will receive a message about this chaotic person. This was a lick or they got a lick pulled on them. Whoever they went to, oh, look, escape in reverse. This person can't. This person can't escape here. This relationship of convenience. This girl and this chick. This that that's whoever this chick is. The smoke break. <laughs> Woo! I'll tell you later.